So if you've seen just a few of my videos, you may have noticed that I use an SPG seasoning uh, on um, many of the food I cook. And so today I'm going to show you exactly what it is I use uh, for that. And it's pretty simple. This is going to be a little black pepper, coarse black pepper. I've got kosher uh, salt right here, which I've also used uh, sea salt before and that has been fine. Granulated garlic not the powder we want the granulated garlic and paprika we're going to add i'm using the spanish style you can use uh, smoked paprika i've done that before or just regular paprika and we're just going to add a little bit of cumin and a little bit of onion powder so this is not your standard spg which is basically just equal amounts of salt pepper and garlic uh, it's a little bit of a season off this will work great on really anything. So I'm going to go ahead and put this together. We got a mixing bowl here and we're going to start out with some black pepper. So this is not a huge amount. It'd be enough for a little mixing bowl. We're going to do three cups of this. That's one, two, and three. Next, I'm gonna just go ahead and add this kosher salt in here, and we're gonna do one and a third cups of this. Okay, then we're going to add the granulated garlic. So let's put one third cup of this. And then we're going to add some ground, uh, ground cumin and onion powder. Going to add two, uh, two tablespoons of the onion powder and one tablespoon of the cumin. This is only a, a one half, so this is the onion powder, which I'm going to add two. That was a half. One. Just about out. One and a half. Eh, put the rest of that. So that's two. And we're going to add one tablespoon of this. So, got it all in my mixing bowl, and I've got a little stand-up mixer here. If you have a portable mixer, you can use it if you want to do it by hand, whatever. But this will work fine. Just going to place this down in here, lock it in. I want to start on slow so the spices don't get too crazy in the air. You really want to mix it for quite some time and get it all evenly mixed up. So it is an oaky smoking video. And if you've watched any of my videos, you also know I always mess up. We never did put this in. So I'm going to add this now. Just one third cup. It would have been okay without it, but I do want the paprika. So I'm, I poured uh, some of it back in and we're pouring the rest of it back in. So now this is what we had mixed up. And now we're going to go ahead and add one third cup of this uh, paprika. That'll be good. Add that to it. Look at that nice color. And then we're going to redo this. Now 
Now that looks right. It's got that uh, paprika look. I don't know why I didn't notice it, but uh, as I was editing the video and everything, I realized we never did add any of the paprika. So there we go. That's my SPG season all that I use on, uh, you can make ribs with it, brisket, all your meats, burgers, as well as just at the table, add it to your tater tots, add it to your fries. It don't matter. And there you go. You might label it. You might label it correctly, but that right there is my SPG season all that uh, we use for just about everything. Works great. Seafood even. Uh, so, uh, that's how I make the SPG. Next time you hear me say SPG, uh, this is what I'm using right here. 